What time is it? Good lord. Chapter 5. Apologies. <laughs> okay, how many chapters does Sting have? I don't know. There's a lot. When do we become friends? I don't know. This is, right now is being a real choke. This is all just a... Wow. Whew, the last comment here is not nice. So let's see what happens. Really? Woohoo, Bryce! That was freaking awesome. Gene was ecstatic. I saw that everyone else was smiling too. Ryan and Annie were doing their best to hide it, but I could see a small grin creeping upon their faces. Perhaps it was unwise of me to give Aaron more reasons to dislike me, but at that moment, I didn't really mind. I mean, I had hit him in the face two times now. How cool was that? Seeing Aaron's Aaron's eyes widen with fear was too satisfying. However, when Coach Aaron. Ir Erwin finally lifted him off the ground and started carrying him to the infirmary. I saw that Aaron was bleeding profusely, clearly in a lot of pain, possibly a broken nose or needing stitches. Disgusting. Watching him be dragged away in that state almost made me feel bad. Practice is over, brats. The next time we see you, we will announce who made it cut. Who made the cut for our team? Levi looked over the bloody soccer ball that hit Aaron with disgust. And I expect to see this ball completely spotless and all uniforms cleaned of grass stains. Got it? No more marijuana. Dismissed. <laughs> what a f killjoy. <laughs> Mara, don't you wanna? Everyone crowded around me as, as, uh, as we walked to the locker room and chatted excitedly about the end of practice. Damn, Bryce, you really didn't hold back. Great job. <laughs> Connie high-fived me. <laughs> Connie. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, that kid looked like he wasn't going to touch a soccer ball anytime soon, Ryan added with a slap on my back. Yes, that was impressive, Connie commented quietly. So I was like, yes, that was very impressive. Before I could get pulled into the locker room to change, I decided I should stop by the firm to check on Aaron. The least I could do was apologize. When I arrived outside, I saw Mikasa and Armin hurtle, huddled around Aaron. Mikasa was trying to wake him while Aaron consoled him. I couldn't see his piercing teal eyes from here. So they must have been shut. The second I stepped into the door, Mikasa appeared beside me and shoved me into the wall. She so kicked my legs from underneath me and flipped me into the floor. <coughs> Excuse me. My head hit the concrete hard and my vision went blurry. She pushed my chest uh, into the floor with a foot. <laughs> if you ever come near him again, I will hurt you in a way you cannot even fathom. She threatened. I came here uh, to apologize. <laughs> I said between short breaths. God, I was in so much pain. Mikasa, please. I'm sorry it was an accident. Armin pleaded. Let's just give her some space to apologize. Mikasa backed off. Face, that's the accident. <laughs> <laughs> Mikasa backed off and stormed out the nurse's office. Armin tailing close behind. I did my best to bring my head off the floor and not a not a quick thank you in his direction. He smiled back timidly. He wished me good luck. I was going to need it. This man's passed out. After about five minutes, when I was capable of standing up again, I. <laughs> Rehaved? I heaved myself over to Aaron's bed. I wanted to check how bad his injuries were, but he still had a lot of dried blood splattered all over his face. It was kind of gross to look at. Firm, like, aren't they gonna clean that shit up? <laughs> I was in the same thing. Well, that's well, that's Treve. If they clean the bodies, <laughs> so when you take someone into the hospital, Treve, do they just leave him bloodied? <laughs> 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 like, mm, you got a little something on your. That, that you might want to. Oh, you can't move. Oh, okay. You want to lick your thumb and just you know clean it off. <laughs> I grabbed a wet towel and started to clean him, clean him up. He winced when I tried to rinse his lips. Yikes! His teeth had bitten down to his lower lip pretty hard. It looked like he'd need stitches. Thankfully, his nose wasn't broken, which was surprising since it would have should definitely should have been. Aside with a leaf. <sighs> After all, he was passed up by the nurse. I waited for him to wake up. Aaron, I said, shaking his arm. Aaron! His eyes fluttered and he grumbled, grabbed my arm. Mika, so leave me alone. Wake up! I yelled, slapping across the face. Nice. He jolted awake and his bright two eyes were met, met with mine. He touched his cheek in pain. What the hell was that for? Erm. Um, oh, wait, I'm talking. 
and <laughs> I had no excuse for that. Well, Mika said Armin had been waiting for me to leave for a while now. I wasn't going to go home until I apologized. And you were taking so long to wake up. I wanted to watch you sleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I didn't say that. So I decided to speed up the process. He looked at me with anger and confusion, and then pushed me off the chair. Hey! I came here to apologize. You should be grateful that it's had to do anything for an asshole like you, I retaliated. I don't need your pity. Well, that's too damn bad. I threw him with lunch and turned towards the door. Oh, by the way, practice. <laughs> by the way, next practice will be will be told in who made the team. I stopped. And I'm sorry. Bryce, um, thanks. He paused. Also, if I'm not stuck here by tomorrow, could you maybe let me know if I made it to the team? Why can't you let Mikasa do it? I sneered. <clears throat> Mikasa wouldn't have the heart to tell me if I failed, he said. I didn't reply. That was kind of weak. As expected, Aaron wasn't in, in class or practice the next day. Coach Erwin lists off the names of people who made it to the team. Reiner Braun, Ymir Fritz, Annie Lon Lionheart, Lee Lionheart, Leon Hot. <laughs> Le <laughs> <laughs> Mikasa Ackerman, no surprises there. Erwin continued. Sasa Blouse, uh, Connie Spring Springer, Jean Christine, Kristen, it's Kristen here. He had an eye in before. And then Bryce, Danny. Ooh, there was a small cheer that came <laughs> that came after that my name was mentioned. Brats, Levi commented. And Aaron Yeager. He finished. We leave tomorrow morning. <laughs> Levi added, "Don't forget to bring your practice uniforms. I'm not going to let a school be humiliated by MP because we're unorganized and sloppy." Hmm, I guess that means I don't... I'll have to talk to Aaron again. Weirdly enough, I didn't actually mind. In fact, I was almost looking forward to it? Question mark? Maybe it was because there was... Sexual tension. The plot thickens. Maybe it was because there was a small chance we might actually be friends. Or not friends. Maybe better than enemies. The group decided to go to dinner to celebrate, but I had to pass to say hi to Aaron. God, this would be s this would be a lot easier if he had given me a number. Then I wouldn't have to look. Aaron wants us to visit. He's <laughs> simping. Mm -hmm. Then I wouldn't have to put my life on hold for him. It's so inconvenient. Damn. How long has Aaron been in the infirmary? Good lord! I found Aaron still in the infirmary after practice and told him that the good <laughs> news. He was thrilled. Wait, actually, finally, take that, Mikasa! He threw up his fist in the air and then realized I was still there. Well. He said aloofly. See you later. <laughs> it's not yeah. actually that I made it that much of a surprise, really. I already knew I was going to make it. He scratched his head and blushed in embarrassment. Well, congrats, Aaron. I hope everything works out for you. I turned to go. Even though I looked forward to these short exchanges, I really didn't have anything else to say to him. Ah, uh, um, Bryce. Do you think you'd send me a list of things of everything we need for tomorrow? <laughs> I scoffed. Just ask Mika that prick. In the world. <laughs> that was a scoff. I don't want to ask. Oh. Hold on. <clears throat> Guys, what is the best uh, buccaneer? I would say the military path, the path at the top. That said, oh. if you go to the middle path, you'll get a harpoon that can instantly destroy more webs. What the f are you sure? Mm-hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. Ooh, they don't get another try because you guys have the other two. Alright, sorry, continue. That's good. Oh, I have all of them, so don't worry, Danny. You can't. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Oh, I'm overwhelmed. I don't want to ask. <laughs> Aaron screamed in pain. <laughs> I turned around to see his teal eyes <laughs> glittering with fear as blood dripped Why from his lips. Like <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to explain myself to you. <laughs> he looked down, he was playing, he was, I was paying attention to his words and accidentally rebit himself. 
I sighed and walked back over to help clean him up. When everything was said and done, he sent me forward when I got up to leave. I stumbled, but didn't laugh. He laughed to himself? God, what is this kid's problem? <laughs> and then the two top two comments was, Lamau, dumb bitch. <laughs> <laughs> <What>? <laughs> that's all, that's all he wrote.